Hello, dear students. The first subject uh, in digital fundamentals for first semester in this academic year. Uh, I will explain about number systems in a computer and uh, some operations on these numbers. The first type of number systems is decimal numbers. You are familiar with the decimal number system because you use decimal numbers every day. Number of students inside the class is decimal. Uh, for example, uh, 32 students. Uh, your phone number uh, it's decimal and uh, every number that we use it in uh, our life is decimal. Uh, let's take some characteristic for decimal number. The decimal number system has 10 digits. A digit, that's mean uh, one number, it's digit. Now we have uh, 23. So 3 is digit and 2 is digit. T uh, why it's 10 digits? Because it starts from 0, 1, 2, 3, up to 9. So it's 10 uh, digits. If I want to express uh, more than uh, 9, for example, 100 or one, uh, 122, for example, 122 in uh, decimal, so I need for 3 digits. In decimal, each digit has weight according to its position. In Arabic, we said ahad, asharat, mi'at, uluf. So uh, two, it's um, ahad, so it would be multiplied by one. Yes. And next one, it will multiply by ten. It's multiplied by one. Next one, it will multiply by one hundred. If we have another uh, value here, for example, four thousand, so that means it's multiplied with 1,000. Uh, 1, uh, in this example, uh, they explain that uh, uh, the position of the number, for example, uh, 23, so 3 multiplied by 1. Why uh, 1? Because 1 is 10 to power 0. And next value, 10 to power 1. The next one, 10 to power 2 which is 100, 10 to the power 3, uh, which is uh, 1000, and so on. The decimal number system has base of 10. How can I express the number? Uh, it's in decimal. Uh, for example, this number, 4122. So I will put it between the brackets, and I will write 10. That means this is in binary. Um, 23 also 23 I will put it between the brackets and I will write 10 that's mean this is in decimal so the value of a digit is determined by its position in the number for positive part we don't have problems now if we have fractional part fractional part uh, we mean if we have uh, 2.5 or 3.02 so the point here it's decimal point the values after the decimal point it's in positive part and this part is negative part for positive part same as the previous uh, example according to the position but uh, before the decimal point we will uh, uh, multiply it by 10 to the power minus 1 10 to power minus 2, 10 to power minus 3. Now, uh, 10 to power 0, we know it's 1. 10 to power 1, uh, uh, 10. And this is 100. Okay? What about 10 to power minus 1? 10 to power minus 1, that's mean 1 divided by 10, which is equal to 0 0.1. And uh, 10 to the power minus 2, that's mean 1 uh, divided by 100, which is equal to 0 0.01. Now let's take an uh, example. Let's express the decimal number 568. 
point twenty three as sum of values of each digit. So this is uh, eight. It will multiply it by ten to power zero, ten to power one, and five multiplied by ten to power two. What about two? It will multiply it by ten to power minus one, ten to power minus two. So the result it will be five hundred plus sixty plus eight plus zero point two plus zero point zero three. So uh, the summation it will be three two eight. Six, five. Uh, let's go for a very important number system type is uh, binary numbers. Uh, the computer language uh, and quantities inside the computer, uh, quantities I mean uh, the information inside computer, for example, uh, video, audio, and uh, image, all of them, they are expressed by using binary numbers. In computer so let's see what's the difference between uh, the decimal and binary the binary number system has two digits why two digits because it's zero or one okay how can I count in binary because I have just zero and one if I need more numbers uh, I need to add another digits according to the value of numbers the binary number system has a base of 2. That means if I want to express that this number in, uh, in binary, I'll put it between the brackets and I will write 2. Now, uh, same decimal number. For each digit, uh, we can calculate the weight according to its position. Uh, suppose here there is point. This is the fractional part the positive power and negative power of 2 so uh, this part it will multiply it by 2 to power 0 2 to power 1 which is 2 2 to power 2 it's 4 2 to power 3 it's 8 and so on for this numbers you should keep it in your mind for a fractional part 2 to power minus 2 that's mean 1 divide by 2 so uh, we know uh, it's half, so 0 0.5. 2 to the power minus 2, 1 uh, divided by uh, 4 because it's uh, 2. So 0 0.25. And 2 to the power uh, minus 3 and so on. So just uh, keep in your mind uh, these up to 4 numbers, it's uh, enough. So, how you can um, memorize this one? Uh, keep it like this 525, 125, 625. Um, I think it's enough up to uh, minus 4. So, let's take an example. Convert the binary number, which is uh, this number, to decimal. How can I know uh, how much this number in binary? So it's based on 2. This is binary. It's equal to what in decimal? What's the answer? So according to uh, weight of each digit, now uh, this one, it will divide by, uh, sorry, multiplied by 2 to the power 0. This 2 to the power 1, okay, and uh, 2 to the power 2, and so on. Now, uh, let's find the result. 1 to the power 0 is 1. 0 multiplied by 2 to the power 1, it is 0. No need to write it. So it's zero. 
1 multiplied by 2 to power 4, which is equal to 4. We finish this one. 1 multiplied by 2 to power 3, which is 8. 0 multiplied, I will not calculate it because it is 0, and no need to write it. 1 multiplied by 2 to power 5, you should know uh, how much 2 to power 5, 2 to power 6, 2 to power 7, because in the exam, it's not allowed to use calculator. So, 2 to power 5, it's 23. How, uh, how we know it's 23 according to this uh, schedule? 2 to power 6, it is 64. So, it's equal to uh, 32. And when multiplied by uh, 2 to the power 6, it is 64. Find the summation of this, and it's equal 109. So I will write here 109 in decimal. This number in binary equal to this in decimal. Uh, let's take another example. Convert the fractional binary number to decimal. We said uh, before the fractional uh, part, uh, sorry, uh, this is binary, binary point. Why, it, why I didn't say decimal point? Because the number is in binary. Now, uh, this, the negative uh, part, so 0, it would multiply by 2 to the power minus 1. Yes, minus 1, minus 2. Minus 3, minus 4. So according to this schedule, to this schedule, up to 2 to the power minus 4, it's uh, enough. Now 2 to the power minus 1, it's 0 0.5. 2 to the power minus 2, we don't need it because it's 0. 0 multiplied with any value, it's 0. Uh, next, 2 to the power minus 3, it's 0 0.125. Uh, 2 to the power minus 4 or 625. So, uh, how we can find the summation of uh, these numbers? So, 0 0.5 plus 0 0.125 plus O point O six two five. So zero after by uh, after decimal point. Now it's decimal point. Uh, five one which is six uh, two. Uh, with 6 it will be 8 and 5 with 2 it will be 7 and 5 so this number it's equal to between the brackets 0 0.6875 in decimal this is the answer now try to solve related problems convert this number to decimal and convert the binary number we have here a positive part and a negative power part to decimal and if you have any question I am uh, I will answer it in online session thank you